Let's get them Tootsie Toodles and Tenderonies up for our pal Faces K. Blang! Blang! Pinky in the Pinky in the what's that? The Pinky in the Stinkies? And there's the horns to you, my friend. We are back with the bleeding black exploited. Right? Uh, we did Beat the Bastards, Beat the Bow. We did a live video of them doing that. It's the biggest tune that they got. Uh, but they've been around for 50 years. And uh, in that video, uh, Faces K was down there in the comments, and he says, uh, they got a great song off that record called They Lie. So I says, oh, I want to hear that. Um, so that's what we're here to do. We're doing They Lie from The Exploited for our buddy. Um, we learned about The Exploited. Maybe they'll have a good biography here that we can really d dive richly into and learn about the band, and then we'll listen to the song. If you've never heard The Exploited before... They got a new album called, no, 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 I, I, I thought it said 2023, it said 2003. We'll get to that. We'll get to all that. Let's learn about this band, then listen to the song, The Exploited. They got 147,000 monthly listeners to the Bleeding Blatty Spot uh, thought account. Top five jams, number one banger here is Beat the Bastards. 5 million plays. You got Sex and Violence, 4.8 million plays. Fuck the USA. That's got 4.4 million plays. Chaos is my life. 1.7 million plays. Alternative comes in at 1.6 million plays. That's the top five. Let's look into the albums, and there's got to be stuff here, right? I mean, freaking punk bands put out 14 records DIY style without, without any help from anybody, right? Uh, looks like you got 1981, Punk's Not Dead, Troops of Tomorrow, 1982, Let's Start a War, said, uh, Let's Start a War, dot, dot, said Maggie one day. Let's start a war, said Maggie one day. Uh, Beat the Bastards comes out in 1996, Total, Totally Exploited, 2001, Singles and Rarities, 1980 to 83, 2001, Fuck the System. I mean, really. Uh, 2003, you got Live and Loud, Live at the Palm Cove, 25 Years of Anarchy and dot, 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 Chaos, uh, Apocalypse Tour 1981, Sexual Favors Live, Forever Exploited 2010, The Truly Exploited Collection, The Truly Exploited, The Singles, Dead Cities, Anthology of the Exploited, and The Massacre, 2014. They do a lot of exploiting. The Exploited. They are exploiting every opportunity to put out a record, I'll tell you that. Uh, now we're going to look into just, this will be a cavalcade of all the old school punk that you've never known about or that you've known all about, right? GBH, yes, The Casualties. You've got uh, The Addicts. Uh, total Chaos. I jumped off, uh, quick uh, off, off the track here, um, I jumped off the stage with four beers in my sweats at an Offspring Total Chaos show uh, because I didn't have tickets to get in. So I ran around the back, they started chasing me, the beers fell down into the elastic bands of my feet, and I didn't had nowhere to go but up, so I went up on the stage and out and got into the club that night. Um, Anti-Nowhere League, uh, The Varukers, Chaos UK, The Partisans, One-Way System, Subhumans, oh yeah, Oxymoron, and The Virus. So that is the related artist for the band. We look into the bio ever so quickly, and then we listen to the song, and you got the bleeding bloody guys. He says, how you doing? I'm 65 years old. I got a mohawk standing up right here. And if you say any goddamn thing about it, I'll beat the bastard. And the bastard is you. And I'm saying, hey, man, cool it, dude. Just chill out. I'm a cool, cool guy. One of the leading bands of the second wave of UK punk, The Exploited, championed a raw, no-frill sound that found common ground between fans of street punk, oi, and hardcore with their anthems of anti-authoritarian fury. On early albums like 1981's Punk's Not Dead and 1982's Troop of Tomorrow, uh, The Exploited cranked out buzzy four-square punk uh, and live and livened enlivened by the passions, passionate bark of lead singer Wadi Bukan. Bu 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 
1986, uh, by 1987, when they issued Death Before Dishonor, the Exploited had added elements of crossover thrash metal to the formula, which suited their defiant attack quite well. There we go. Wadi. I know it's something like, it's not Buchan, it's Buchan. Buchan. Wadi Buchan. All right. It is that time. Beat the bastards. We got it a record. We got it a bleeding bloody record right now. I'll tell you what. What song is this? The sixth one in? How many songs? Punk bands always have lots of songs. 13 tracks. How long is it? I bet you I haven't even looked yet. I'm going to say 35 minutes. Ooh, 51 minutes long. All right, we find that song, They Lie. We listen to it right here, right now for our pal, Faces K. This is the titty. I give you a taste, I take a taste. We listen to The Exploited. What can go wrong from that? What, you're not going to have a good time? We're just going to sit here and listen to The Exploited. That's not a good time for you? I don't know what to tell you. Let's do it. I swear my wee sister's like... Swan lights are on a mouse, what? what? Hold on. Who is it? He's right in your bleeding dirty face. I like that. Yeah. Pretty good punky solo. The exploited ever ending out. What tour shows? Two solos. He says, Why do you have two solos in this song? I'm having two solos. One more time. They lie, everyone lie. Here's what he's saying. They lie. I could almost hear the ministry doing this. I could hear Al Jorgensen doing this. If you're sad, boy, that's a great, that's a really good mixed album. I might have to just go and listen to that. I was supposed to go see the Exploited with a with a with a with a, a fella. He was a little bit older than me. I was a young little chap, and he's like, "I'm gonna take you to this seedy club." I mean, nowadays they'd be like, uh, "Dude, you're like 15, and you're going with this grown man with a mohawk to go to a seedy little club." But it was going to be the Exploited and the, and Dickhead, the Dickheads, and something else. And I don't remember exactly what happened, but we didn't get to go, and that was the only opportunity that I ever had. Um, and that would have been ironic if I was would have been exploited, quite frankly. I mean, I could see someone in the comments getting down there saying, "Oh yeah, a creepy older guy with a mohawk takes you to the Exploited show." Uh, but what say you? He was a very nice guy. Very nice. Very just a just a, a metalhead and a punk punk head. Um, most important part of my videos is where you get in the comments below and you tell me you say hold your tits, Shane. You don't know a damn thing about what's going on. 
I'm gonna set you straight because I'm the smartest person in the world, especially about this band. You get down there, I read your thoughts and opinions on the bands that we're doing here. We're doing the exploited. You tell uh, your memories. Fantastic memories. Have you ever met Wadi? All of that good stuff. Good, great, fantastic. Shane, let me tell you about my love and long-lasting love and love ship with the Exploited. I have loved them since the very first tune that I heard on the very first record of the very first day that they came out. Um, all-time favorite albums, all-time favorite songs. You had to have seen them. Um, I, I have not seen them, but I, you know, I, I feel like if you're a huge fan of this band, you had to have seen had at least 40 opportunities because this is like unrelenting tour type of band, right? They might be up there with Cheap Trick and B.B. King on the most shows ever played. Uh, but uh, get down there and tell me all of that. Or you could say, not good, not great. Shane, I'm not a punk fan. Um, these guys were perfectly fine. Uh, as far as that goes, but if I tip, tap my tip my little titsy toodles down into some punk rock, it's usually something like Blink-182 or something. So, so this is not my cup of tea. Don't want it, don't need it, never going to listen to it again. All of that can be put in the comments below. If you are the type of guy who likes to move around, or a fine, fine young lady, or whomever you choose to be, um, if you've got a request, you want to see it on the channel, and you're saying, I, I really want to do this, Mary Bell. I really want to see if I can get a request on it. It's very simple. Hit the links, or you can put it in the comments. If you put, and when I say hit the links, I guess I shouldn't mean like go ride a horse at the park or something. Isn't that the links as well? I would say hit the links that are down there in the description. It's where you can contact me and you can purchase a request if you have something like that on your mind, or you don't even have to purchase. You can just put it in the comments. If I see it, like it, and you and we haven't done it on the channel yet, you'll know uh, because I'll hit it with a heart tell you I'm going to do your request. You sit back, you wait, you forget about it. It pops up on the channel. Everybody's so happy. If you join the Patreon, you just shoot me your requests any old time you're feeling frosty. Faces K is one of those fine folks. Anytime he goes, man, you should do this. We check, we see if we've done it, and we say, it's coming up for you, buddy. It's coming up for you, pumpkin. It's coming up for you, sweet cheeks. Don't you worry about that. It's coming. Uh, all right, swinging out. There's your thumbs. We go. The exploited.